Fernando asked me how to memorize anatomy information and he gave me this diagram. So in this video, I'm going to teach you how to memorize a diagram with a memory palace. So let's get started. So the first thing you need to do is create a memory palace with as many locations as you have pieces of information. So for this diagram, we have 16 different parts. So we have a memory palace with 16 different locations. Then you're going to have to change all of the names for the different parts into images. So for example, Maxilla would be Godzilla. Um, temporal bone would be a temple made of bones. You get the idea, right? And then the last part is you're going to combine them both, right? You're going to place your image into the location. But what I like to do is I like to keep it really organized. And so I would just go clockwise or counterclockwise. So if I go clockwise, the first location is going to have Maxilla. So say if that's, um, I don't know, a chair, I picture Godzilla, you know, just, just crushing this chair, like, boom, just steps on it. Okay, then the second location, say that's a fridge, um, sphenoid bone, um, I think of a pen making noise with a bone. So maybe this pen is banging the fridge and making a whole bunch of noise. And I would just continue. And so what would happen is I get the diagram again, but this time all of the information is whited out. And so I'm like, okay, let's go. So here I started clockwise, right? Oh yeah, the very first line, that's gonna be the first location. I see Godzilla crushing a chair. Oh yeah, Godzilla, Maxilla. Boom, move to the next one. Oh yeah, the second one is the fridge, that's the second location. Oh yeah, I see this pen making a whole bunch of noise, banging the bone against the fridge. Oh yeah, sphenoid bone. And so you just go through the whole process and recall all the different parts because the lines are gonna be corresponding to what you memorize. And there you go. That is a very easy and quick method you can use to help you memorize diagrams. Hopefully you enjoyed this video and I'll see you next time.